Good morning, staff, students, and parents, if you're there. Today is October 27th, 2020. I hope you are having a very sick free day uh, at home and doing virtual learning. So, Dimas, I believe there's a lot of birthdays since our four day weekend. Uh, so, what are those birthdays? Well, we have a four. We had a four day weekend, but not that many birthdays. Okay, starting off in for the twenty third, we have Emilio Gonzalez for the, and that is all for the twenty third. Now, for the twenty sixth, we have Amaya Pearson, and for the twenty seventh, oh, and another birthday from the twenty sixth is. Melania Chestnut. Um, for the twenty seventh, we have Amelia Folkler and Nia Beeson. Beeson. That is all for birthdays. Hey Kai, what is today's national day? Sorry if he butcher butchered your name. By the way, um. <laughs> Today's do. Today's national day. Actually, yesterday's national day was sourest day. It's a day where someone literally walks up to you and gives you a lemon to make you feel grumpy for the rest of that day. You, we all know the saying: "Life when life gives you lemons, make lemonade." AKA saying, "When something bad happens, make the better of the situation." But if we were in New Zealand which we're not, we would, that saying would be, when life gives you lemons, take that person, the lemon, and the lemons back to the police because it's illegal to give someone lemons in New Zealand. Have the nice, ha, ha, hmm. it's not the end of the announcements. <laughs> wow. Um, that is such fantastic information. You gave us so much to think about right there. I love that. Thank you so much. Did you want to add anything else, Rowan? No. Okay, thank I you. Hope someone comes up to you and gives you a lemon to make you mad for the rest of the day. So this is sourest day as opposed to sweetest day, which many of you may celebrate. Well, now we just have another day to celebrate, so I'm excited about that. But, hey, it is Trivia Tuesday, so listen to this. I've got a question for you. And uh, my co-announcers helped, helped me to write this one. What two things does a white dove symbolize? When you see a white dove, what does it symbolize? Winter, love, marriage, peace. Which two of those two does a white dove symbolize? Winter, love, marriage, peace. Two of those answers. Submit your answer and we'll see who's the winner. Anything else for us today for our announcements? Take it away. Personally, I didn't know what Sweetest Day is. So just in case you didn't, um, Sweetest Day happens on Saturday, October 17th. Um, sweetest Day, most people think it's a second Valentine's Day when it's not. Um, Sweetest Day began in Cleveland, 1922, when a man named Herbert Birch Kingston decided to bring a little happiness to the lives of orphans, shuttons, and others who were often forgotten. Well, hope you have a nice rest of your day, but I'll let someone else close because I'm not that good at it. Okay, we all know you are. Anyway, so um, that is the end of the announcements. I hope you go up to someone, give them a lemon, and make them very mad for the rest of the day. Or I hope you get very mad for the rest of the day because you've got a lemon. Or you make your life happy and you make uh, a key lime pie. Anyway, so uh, <laughs> that's the end of the announcements for today.